welcome to part two. I've left off the same thing. Now it is going to be the same thing. Also, I'm still working on the bumper. I'm thinking of adding a screw a little long. I think these, this little one should do it. Now I just have to add a nut. The reason why they just don't give us real screws because there aren't as many inputs. So we just need to put nuts and bolts and screws. And also screws are sharp. Yes, I do have a big one, which is totally sharp. You might just laugh and say, how are screws only sharp? These are not screws, these are all bolts. I have said they're screws because only the little ones are screws. Okay, I've done a smooth wheel. Now I just, add, I just have to add a bumper. I should have added this. Okay, I'm going to take this off and put in this. Okay. No. And yeah, I am like to do it the right way. And okay. This is kind of awkward like that. Okay, this is a bit impossible. Yes, this is impossible. thinking of putting this as the bumper. So I'm actually still thinking but I need to do it quick. So I'm just gonna not gonna add a bumper. Why? Because I want this to be like a wreckage car. What I mean by wreckage car is just a, it's going to, going to go a big fast. It's going to go fast. That's all I mean. else yeah I'm going to I know the camera's just moving so I'm not sure I don't know why isn't there yeah I also need to put in the battery which I need to take out the batteries a battery in a battery Yes, this is a battery, and inside there are two double A's, which power the motor. Yeah, these day woos, which they, if I'm going to recommend batteries, first is obviously going to be draw cell. They are the best. Then I'm going to recommend Daewoo. After that, Kodak. After that, after Kodak, 
is going to be Panasonic. Oh, no Panasonic. Panasonic Auto Say is the worst. Panasonic is the worst, if I want to say. Like in recommendations. Panasonic is the worst. Those are the best. After, like, in the best, better than Panasonic is Sony. Sony batteries. After the Sony batteries, better than the Sony batteries are the Kodak. Then it's yeah, they will draw some. All the others I, I I just don't know because they might they might be just in other countries. I'm going to make this a six wheel, but a four wheel drive. 6x4, maybe? Yeah, 6x4. I need this screw and this screw. What I'm going to do, I'm going to attach these. Attach. Attaching is not really that easy. I just think I'm just putting in screws and holes and nuts. And build bolt. No. It's not that easy. And putting in a screw too much inside a motor can actually affect the motor itself. Look at this. I'm thinking of using an extension. Yeah. Extension. The two greens. The green's the smallest, the yellows are kind of big, oranges are the biggest, yeah. Yellow and orange look the same, but to be honest, they are not the same. I don't think, actually no, orange, the colour code. I don't think I really need, I need, I need one though. I yeah, don't really need the greens, so I'm just going to use two mini screws. The thing we can screw the bolt is a screw has a little sharp point, whereas a bolt is long, and a bolt is usually like. Here. I don't really need the fifth and sixth wheel. If I actually had three sets, I'll put three motors in. I'm literally that crazy. <laughs> Not really crazy, I just want I just want to see how fast it actually goes. Yeah. Also in, also if you have a screwdriver set. I don't really like recommend using like Tommy Walsh. I recommend using professional hardware tools, JK ones. Because they're the ones I actually use and i I actually have the Tommy Walsh ones. I'll just recommend JK. I don't mean JK Rowling. I actually mean this type of JK. Sometimes it's just kind of just this time to take out a nut. Why are most of my videos, why do most of my videos say that the comments are disabled? 
Well, I put the option made for kids and that allows it to put it and that makes it go on YouTube Kids because obviously they're made for kids. I'm thinking of another way of doing this. But I still need to do some parts again. I'm holding the nut and turning the screw so that the nut goes with the screw and then yeah, it comes off. What I'm going to really do is just take this off. Done. Now, I'm just going to add this on so that it just got squeezing tight. Yeah. Going to put in. One. was a one space. I just want a one space gap so that I don't end up using too much screws. Because I might put all my extra screws in some extra thing. Like putting in a battery. Like things like that. I'm just saying battery too many times. And I put on the battery, not how I actually used to do. Also another thing, I'm going to put another battery because I need one. kind of easy to put in if you put on the right screw that is Now I'm going to use my spanner. Okay, the joke is why did okay, why did I think this joke might be good with your friends. Why did the chicken cross the road to get to the idiot's house? Then, knock knock, and your friend says who's there, obviously. Then, you say, the chicken. Yeah. First, your friend might not actually know what you're talking about. Then, he or she might actually know what you're trying to do.
Okay, so I'm actually going to test my little car, which actually doesn't have any seats. I just made a test one. Now I'm going to put you into the two batteries. And I'm not actually going to put little. I'm going to actually, I'm going to first put on one motor on. That is when I put one motor. If I put on two motors, you just heard that big pop. That was nothing, which was one motor. Now, it just nearly went up my set. As you have heard and saw, these wheels go furiously fast. I'm going to see if I can actually knock over a tower that I'm actually going to make. Yeah, I'm going to make a tower and I'm actually going to see if I can knock it off with my little car, which is actually quite powerful. powerful. First I'm going to put on a cross. I'm not going to make a cross, but kind of like a cross. So one screw, a bolt, maybe, then here. A nut. The, then I'm going to add one, two, three, four, and then four. I'm not just wasting screws and nuts. I want it to be as spaced out as possible, so I'm actually going to be like versing myself, challenging myself to be honest. Just tidy it up with the spanner. Okay. Now I'm going to get the other three. You can fast forward five or ten seconds from now. Right now, okay, I'm going to tighten these up. Make sure I don't want it to be floppy and then go down. If I had Lego, I wouldn't do this with Lego. Because obviously Lego is kind of strong. But if, if I had Mega Blocks and Lego, I would actually go for Mega Blocks. Okay, the final one, which is not really tightened. Okay, I have tightened this up. I'm going to add these two big ones. are furiously big. Yeah. 
can see actually. It is like it does take a bit of time. At the first, at, at, in part one, I have actually seen that you have actually seen that tank that I made before. That actually needed, I think, three hours to make it furiously fast. Because what I wanted to do to make it furiously fast is to add some, as small components as I can and make it look quite realistic, which I actually couldn't. Okay. really done. I'm going to put in two knots mid air. Okay, now I'm actually going to put on this. So it won't fall all the way down, but it'll just stay in midair. Let's actually put those two. I'm going to use two washers. And this is one washer. I have it here. Put it in. What washers do, they just wash off any extra space. So it's tight. I should actually put the washers at the bottom, but at the top, it is kind of better. Holding it there, and I am going to put this there. This actually moves. Now, let's see if we can actually. Package this. So, three, two, one. Took it all the way, but wasn't able to make it do that. Because obviously, how would it do it? Like, it would be impossible. kind of artillery like, you can see aiming aiming then yeah that is kind of cool you can't 
can actually do this. Just like kind of boring, but also kind of fun. Boring fun, yeah. Also, you know that I'm actually going to try and put this on here so that, like, it looks like a gun right now, it looks like a mobile tank two wheels this and then it just goes in yeah I just keep doing that lightning bolt thing just so cool anyway thank you for watching see you later bye bye also see you in my next video